Hello, I'm Tony from Bonners Piano Centre and this is my buyer's guide to the brand new Yamaha CLP775 Digital Piano. If after watching this video you want to come and try these pianos for yourself then please come to one of our stores. We have showrooms in Eastbourne on the south coast, Rygate in Surrey just off of Junction 8 of the M25 motorway and we also have a large showroom in Milton Keynes just off of the M1 motorway. You can compare the CLP775 with other models in Yamaha's digital piano range and also compare it with other models from different manufacturers just to make sure you're making the right decision when you're buying a new piano for yourself or your family. So the CLP775 features some of the very best piano technology that Yamaha has ever put into their digital instruments. First of all, they've re-recorded the sound of their Concert Grand piano. That's the sound of the CFX Concert Grand. And this new piano sound, as you're going to hear in a second, is absolutely beautiful. So to further enhance the piano sound, Yamaha have also included some technology that they call Grand Acoustic Imaging. And that kind of sums up a few different characteristics of the speaker system. So first of all, the speaker placement inside the cabinet is different to previous digital pianos. And it gives a sense of the sound coming from sort of all around the instrument rather than being focused sort of centrally. Um, there are some transducers, which are little microphones that vibrate the cabinet so that when you play a chord and you, if you play, place your hand on the cabinet, you actually feel it vibrating the same um, that an acoustic piano would vibrate when you're when you're playing an acoustic piano and of course again that further in, it's using the the actual cabinet itself to to create the sound so you really get a sense that you're kind of in touch with the instrument when you're playing it and it's it's responding more like an acoustic instrument uh, than any other digital pianos have done in the past so let's just take a listen to the first piano sound. This is the CFX concert. I'm going to play you a few notes but just listen to the quality of the sound. So as you could hear that that that's a stunning piano sound and I must say that the keyboard action this is Yamaha's grand touch keyboard action but it's been improved for the 700 series and it's uh, to me it feels like a slightly lighter action than the previous range um, the CLP 775 is a linear graded action and what that means is that it's heavier at the bottom and lighter at the top but it, it gradually gets lighter as you move up the keyboard each note as you travel up the keyboard just like an acoustic grand piano gets lighter and lighter and lighter till you get to the to the top octave so it really is a pleasure to play so i'm just going to play you a quick piece of music using this new cfx concert grand just so you can hear it in context what i'm also going to do halfway through is i'm actually going to layer a string voice with my piano sound as well so you're going to hear the piano sound on its own first of all but because the CLP775 has a total of 38 voices in it so that's lots of different instrument sounds electric pianos harpsichords organs um, strings choirs all sorts of things you can actually layer any two you want together so you just press the dual button down there and you can layer two sounds together so I'm going to put the orchestral strings with the piano as well so it really is a pleasure to play this instrument just just have a listen to this.
So I think you'll agree that was a really beautiful uh, piano sound and I love the way that you can layer the orchestral strings which are actually quite authentic string sound over the top of the piano um, and it just gives a really lovely playing experience. Now the CLP775 has a really powerful speaker system but even at low volume it's a high quality speaker system. It's not just loud, it actually sounds really nice at lower volumes as well. Um, there's even tone controls built in so um, this is the first time I've seen this on a Yamaha digital piano where you can alter the bass, the middle and the treble controls of the of the instrument sound so you can tailor the sound to the the room you've got it in so um, sometimes you might find that uh, perhaps your, your piano could do with a little bit more bass or perhaps take the treble down a little bit you can do that with a CLP 775. Now if you're buying a digital piano to perhaps use in an apartment or a, in a household where you don't want to disturb others when you're practicing then of course headphones uh, is a very very important consideration. Now, uh, Yamaha have developed a recording technique called binaural sampling and both the CFX concert grand piano sound and the Bosendorfer piano sound, which I'm going to show you in a second, um, have been recorded using this binaural sampling technique. And what it means is that they've actually made a recording of the piano uh, from the position of the player. So when you plug headphones in, you hear these binaural recordings of the piano sounds and it sounds like the sound is coming from all around you not just in through your two ears here it feels like uh, there's a bit of space around the sound so it makes a much more pleasurable ex playing experience uh, when you're using headphones especially for long periods of time now um, I've tried this feature with the CLP 775 and when you put headphones on and you start playing you have to just quickly check that no one else can hear you because it sounds um, like the sound is coming sort of slightly in front of you and with more space around it um, and it almost feels like it's, it's the true sound of the piano coming out of its own speakers yet it's through your headphones so if you are buying a piano for, for use with headphones then the 775 is a really good consideration because of the binaural sampling. So as I've already mentioned, there are two uh, concert grand piano sounds inside the CLP 775. We've heard the sound of Yamaha's own CFX concert grand, but there's also the sound of the Bosendorfer. So let's have a listen to the Bosendorfer sound. It's a slightly mellower piano sound, lovely for romantic classics, um, but still powerful when you need it to be. So have a listen to this lovely sound. So the CLP775 features this new touch sensitive control panel. It still has the LCD display, but this there are no buttons at all on the control panel. The only button you have is the on off switch on the far right of the keyboard and of course the uh, sliding volume control. But this panel hides itself so when you're not when you're not touching it 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 just disappears. Now, if you look at the uh, the black piano, so the uh, polished ebony finish, that's a really shiny black finish, um, you can't actually see this at all when it uh, turns itself off. Now, if I just tap it, see all the lights appear 
and then you have your control panel there and it's actually very good so if you're playing in uh, in darker room um, or in the evening we've maybe just got a table lamp on or something next to the piano um, as you could see there it just hid itself again but the the control panel is very very bright and it's very easy to see uh, the buttons that you're looking for so when you're buying a digital piano, as well as considering the sound, the other most important feature that you must consider is the feel of the keyboard. We call it the keyboard action. So the CLP775 features Yamaha's grand touch keyboard action, and it's been improved in this model over previous ranges of Yamaha Clavinovas. Um, it's slightly lighter to the feel, as I've said already, but also, um, you now you need the same amount of pressure no, where, no matter where you press on the key whether it's at the front of the key or the back of the key the same amount of pre pressure needs to be applied and it's the same for both both the black keys and the white keys um, it really is a joy to play but do come to one of our stores where you can actually try this for yourself because I think you'll be really impressed with the the overall playing experience of the CLP 775. So as well as the CFX and Bosendorfer concert grand piano sounds, there are upright pianos, mellow pianos, bright pianos, there's even a honky-tonk piano. Um, but Yamaha have also included two forte piano sounds. Now, forte pianos are very early musical instruments uh, from hundreds of years ago, um, and they've, they've included two uh, piano sounds in here. One's called Chopin, one's called Mozart, and they've recorded the actual piano uh, instruments from that era um, of that particular composer to, so that you can get an authentic sound for some of their pieces of music. So I've just selected the Mozart one here just as a very quick demonstration for you and you'll hear it's a very different tone to the modern piano instruments that we're used to from nowadays. So the CLP775 is one of the first pianos from Yamaha that features both Bluetooth audio and Bluetooth MIDI. So I have here, I've got an iPad here, and I've downloaded Yamaha's Smart Pianist app for it. And basically the Smart Pianist app takes all of the features of the piano, everything that you would normally control with the normal user interface on the left here, it brings it all up onto the screen of your uh, tablet device. You can either use um, Android or iOS devices um, and it just makes it very, very easy to use. It's the very familiar graphical interface with swipe gestures to change uh, different functions and things. So uh, as you can see here, I've got the grand piano on the screen so I can just play the grand piano voice, but it gives me access to all the other voices and functions that are hidden inside the piano as well. So if we just tap the menu on the left hand side here, I can choose voice and it brings up all of the different piano sounds, the electric piano, so you've got things like your sort of 1970s Fender Road sounds. is uh, DX ballad sound which is this one or you've got organ sounds so you've got things like classical organ or you've got your jazz organ sounds And as you heard earlier, where I layered the orchestral strings with the piano, you've actually got a few different string sounds. So I've got my standard orchestral strings, which is this one. And there are even some very nice choir sounds too. So bass voices as well so you can actually split the keyboard in two so if I change modes now I'm going to press turn on my left hand sound um, on my right I will choose piano and on my left I've chosen the sound of the acoustic bass
So you can split the keyboard and you can put any sound either on the left hand or the right hand, um, or you can layer any two voices you want together. Now, there are some other functions inside the uh, CLP775. So what I'm gonna do now is go down to the metronome. So it gives you, uh, there's a built-in metronome. Again, all of this is controllable from the piano itself. You don't have to use uh, Yamaha's Smart Pianist app. It's just this makes it a lovely graphical interface. So you can, on the screen, select uh, different metronome beats. So if I just have a standard uh, four beat metronome, if you just take a listen to that. So you just get your standard TikTok metronome but there are also drum rhythms built in as well. I've chosen 16 beat there, I'm gonna change my tempo. And now, when I play the piano, there's also a bass line that automatically follows what I'm playing on the piano. So just give you an example of that, I'll just hit the play button. So it makes practicing more fun. Um, you can just have a straight drum beat if you want without the bass line. There are all sorts of styles of music built in. You've got, um, that was just a standard 16 beat rhythm there, but you've got jazz, you've got swing, you've got Latin, you've got some pop stuff. There are even some uh, Christmas uh, rhythms in there as well. So it makes practicing more fun and more fun than just using um, the standard metronome. So the Bluetooth functionality isn't just for Yamaha's own apps. There are thousands of music making apps by third parties available. You can get apps for recording, for tuition, um, and also for um, following uh, the musical printed score on the screen as well. So check out uh, the particular app store for your device to see what's available. So if you're interested in purchasing a new digital piano, check out Bonner's website. You'll find links in the description to this movie. We offer lots of different package options for the CLP775. Um, we offered the piano on its own, but also various uh, combinations of piano stalls and headphones as well. Um, we also offer a delivery service where we can install the piano in your home and build it for you and leave it ready to play. So if you need any more information about digital pianos, please do get in touch or find contact details below this movie. But in the meantime, I hope you've enjoyed it. Please do visit our stores um, or give us a call if you want to discuss digital pianos over the phone. Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you in another one of my piano demonstration movies.